Real YouTubers have bad audio. I apologize. It will be fixed after the intro and also f in the future. Yeah, I feel like I wrote like slanty, slanty intro. Hello, everybody. Um, I'm really scuffed today in terms of my tech setup, so I apologize if the audio doesn't sound good. Um, anyway, what's going on? Um, I'll make this brief because uh, it's unpleasant to look at and listen to. Um, we're playing Radical Red. This is patch 2.2. It's uh, before the current patch. This is because this video is actually um, the live stream for this was actually quite a while ago, like a couple months ago at this point. So um yeah um basically radical red is a hardcore is, is, is a nuzlocke that is centered around competitive pokemon so there's a lot of cool mechanics you have a lot of control over the evs and ivs of your pokemon it's a really cool game um and if you missed it we did take the first three gems in the last episode i recommend you check that out um and in this episode we're gonna be going through kind of picking up where we left where we left off which is the fourth gym and playing through a couple of gyms and gym leader rematches after that so yeah without further ado please enjoy the video bye bye I'm not reading this. I'm done. I'm done being patient. Now it's time for reckless gameplay. Like, I feel like it's, um, if I had, like, focused, this would have been way easier. I was kind of, like, just blowing through it. Yeah. I should have been more careful. I, like, just, I don't know why. In my, I, like, at first I was like, oh, yeah, I need something to make sure Muck wins. But then I, I for some reason, I thought either Glide Score, because this used to have Quick Attack, right? Yeah. Unfortunate. GG. Yeah, I mean, this game is relatively easy, honestly. I don't think... I think that if I focus, it should be, like, no problem. If the difficulty stays like this, it should be... Like, it should be fine. She should heal me, right? Oh, healed me. Okay. Don't speed up. All right. Let's give it a shot. Should be grassy glide. Yep. Let me just double check. Yeah, okay, I'm fine. Should always kill because I'm out of max attack. This is the most scary Pokemon on their team. Thanks to Max HP Max Special Defense, I'm never in any real danger here, as you can see. I go for Flame Charge, which allows me to have speed. It should do like 40% probably. It should be up, still above 50. Yep, not even that much. Whee! Charge Echo Burr. Now, if I mess up my speed calculation, I would actually... Why don't I double check that? I am faster, right? 106? Yeah, that should absolutely be faster. That's bad. That's really bad. That's really, really, really bad. Who said that um, if I had it out, it would never switch? Who said that? It's fine. It's just... It's whatever. Burn? Burn? Yeah. Who can I blame? Listen, I... <laughs> I would have played differently. I would have done things differently. If I had known. It's Iron Barb. It's not bad. I can start healing on this. Okay. Bunny Sword. Probably wants to sludge bomb me, right? And then spike your shield again. Stalling out the terrain is pretty good, I think. Okay, that's fine. Okay, it's actually did a lot more damage than I expected. This thing doesn't have any recovery except for Giga Drain. Um, what I'm actually gonna do here is I'm gonna protect. Get some HP recovery. Yeah, I think it wants to sleep header me. I'm pretty sure it should be sleep header earth power always. So I'm kind of down to go glide score here. I don't think it ever should Giga Drain. Because, and if, because it, it, we're playing with Sleep Claws, so if it puts Glide Score to sleep, then it would not, um, it would no longer be able to sleep out our other mons. Perfect. All right, that's really good. Now it wants to go for Giga Drain. I could have gone Charizard there and Roosted if I wanted. We'll protect here. I actually forgot to give myself good moves, but I think it's okay. Let's go for Steamroller. There's not very much. Earth Heart is a fair chunk as well. Okay, this actually doesn't work, right? I'll steamroller again. If I get a flinch it where it's working though. Okay, Earth Power, 114 and uh do about 50 damage, right? I feel like I might be dead to crit. I'm actually gonna switch into Charizard here and Roost. Okay, I'm gonna roost here. Faster. She does a ton of damage. Um, ah, uh, so annoying. If this poisons, it becomes a little problematic. 
Okay. This actually does a lot of damage. I should just kill him. Maybe I should have just done this immediately. Okay. Head smash again. Okay. More recovery. Down a quick horn leech. Okay, it's in for some reason. I could have killed with hammer arm, but I think this is okay. Fire punch. This shouldn't do very much. My watch is a psycho. Seiko. And barbs. Okay. Down to horn leech again. Okay, it's fine. Reduces my recovery. I don't need Chesnut after this. So it's the third Mon down. So now it's just Superior and Meganium. Meganium is easy too, it's just Superior really. Dazzling Gleam comes out. I'm very bulky. Did a lot of crit me. Yeah, that makes sense. Tentacle probably just sweeps from here, um, but I'm gonna set up a layer of Toxic Spikes anyway. Because I have no really the reason not to. Uh, wait, that's bad. That's actually real bad. Okay, Emerald Kaiser flashbacks. Emerald Kaiser flashbacks. I'm an Acid Spray. Okay, it's fine. It does nothing. Okay, now Sludge is my strongest move. Oh, thank you. Okay, I changed the Liquid Ooze just in case. Okay, thank you, Liquid Ooze. That's gonna be the end of that. So I'm not. This is um, a game for a fairy in this game, which is why my moves are um, which is why my moves are so do so much damage despite not being very invested. Leaf Storm comes out and connects. I could still, in theory, lose this. Probably, although I'm so bulky. This focus sash. I'm gonna protect this turn. That allows me to get the speed boost up and then not speed. I could also make a switch here, but there's no real reason. I'm faster and I can outspeed and KO with Steamroller, so I, there's really no reason to drag this out. I should just finish it. So I'm faster and I get the kill. GG, not bad. Yeah, okay, she's not that hard. You just have to actually like think, making sure you don't get swept by Superior. And also, Venusaur is kind of scary. That's way faster. Okay, Church Wake, not great, but. Oh, the dock is wrong. Well, that feels bad. I should switch to nighttime. The doc said that it was a lonely keeper regardless. Snorlax time. I forgot to give it protect. I'm running, I'm running, I'm running. Just, just, just sack the encounter, right? Agree? Just sack the encounter? It's fine. Okay, it's fine. It's, yeah, yeah. This should be fine now. I could have even burned it if I wanted. I have a really bad feeling about that. But struggling already? Wait, is that struggle? It is, right? Yeah, okay. I can't catch it. I caught it, okay. I feel like I'm missing an item or something. Whatever. The jump off is what I'm most worried about, honestly. I'm a high roller, baby. Let's go for Willow's here. Okay, U turn. Let's find out who they're going into. I hit. All right, Electivar is useless. Ideally, this Volt Switch is here. I'm going to go for Willow's, predicting the Volt Switch. Go a second burn now. Okay. That was like, that did a lot of damage. It's because, um,. Wait, what ability is my Cursula? Cursula. All right, double burns. These guys are no longer problematic. Okay, nice. Should be back into Electivire, but this actually just gives me the ability to, um, can I sweep? Okay, we go back to full HP here. Neither of these mods are threatening anymore. I get, like, I beat both of them already. It's, it wants to Volt Turn spam, but it can't because I am a Lightning Rod one. Which means it cannot switch against me. So now it probably wants to go into Blastoise. I'm gonna click Shadow Bone. It's stupid, never mind. Choose it to sack here. Bye bye. If it shell smashes on me, it's gonna be a little spooky, but I think it's okay. 
I think I... Uh, wait, I think I need some chip damage. I might have made a mistake. Okay, water pulse, that's fine. This is why I wanted toxic spikes up, as I recall. Okay, that's fine. I get fake out off. I'm gonna go for Giga Drain. Yeah, Shell Smash comes out. All right. It's fine. I'm not just at Aura Sphere Crit at plus two. So I should beat the Blastoise now. I should get a Ludicolo Ice Beam so I could potentially stay in on the um, thing. Okay, I don't one shot. Um, this Blastoise will definitely die at some point. It's actually okay to take damage here. I don't die ever. Oh, to crit? No, it's just a lot of damage. Okay. Okay. Oh, wait, they have three Pokemon left. Okay, perfect. This gives me an opportunity to Dragon Dance. Because it's minus one burn, so it doesn't do that much damage. That's super bulky. And now I can sweep, I think, as they U-turn. They should just Brave Bird again. That's actually better for me that they Brave Bird again. Um, I just need to double check that my speed is correct and that I have to be what I think I do. I could go for a second one. Hang on. I really don't want to calc. Okay. It's fine. I'm not in any danger here. Still under or over half. Then I guess go for Aqua Fang. Okay. Quick attack. That's actually good for me because it procs Citrus Berry thanks to the crit. Which means I end up with more HP than I had before. Kill on the Staraptor. One shot the Dramanitan, and I could miss here, but I won't die to Jump Bluff. So even if I miss, it's not the end of the world. I just have to be start getting kind of worried about Jump Bluff. Okay. I, I brought Nine Tails specifically in case something like this happened. Whoa, it didn't. Uh, if it crits me, I die. Wait, no, no, I even for crit. I even for crit. Did not even for crit, apparently. Wait, why did that do so much? Hang on. I thought I even for crit. No, wait, I did. My nine tails doesn't have <gasps> my nine tails doesn't have IVs. It's not IV trained. I forgot to fix the IVs. No, it is. The nature's wrong. Ah! I'm the wrong level. <laughs> okay, there's hang on. Wait, there's a lot of there's a lot of things that are wrong here. It's fine. I'm gonna wear it down. It's now in range of. Jeez, it does so much damage. Well, the thing is that ah, the issue is that. Hex won't kill, and Willis is only 85% accurate, so if I were to miss, I could get swept, right? I can Strength have to leave it at plus one. Okay, this is possibly a mistake. I'm not dead here yet. I really don't think Hex kills. If I miss Willis, I would stack him on. All right, if I miss Willis, I stack him on. Dude, come on, all right. I have a 66% chance of just hex working, right? I could just gamble. Like, I want to stack nine tails, but I can't, right? The situation is this jump love is plus three and I'm dead one out of three times to it. All right, YOLO. <laughs> world champ difference, baby. That's the world champ difference. <laughs> the world champ difference, baby. <gasps> so scary. I can't believe this. Ice Fang and Willow is. And I got my Nine Tails all wrong. It didn't choose to change the nature. If I was timid. I was not a high roll, chat. Do not call me a high roller. The only reason I'm in that position in the first place, I missed Ice Fang and then missed Willow is. All right, this is where I wiped last time during my last successful run. And it's really difficult. And last time, Brendan was just the worst trainer I've ever seen in my entire life. So hopefully this time goes better, but it's still, it feels like there's a lot of variants here. Check the natures. I don't think I did the right natures. I don't know the right natures. I have very much not the right natures. I totally forgot about natures. All right. Yikes, yikes, yikes. All right, it's fine. So according to the chat, it always fake outs my Pokemon turn one. Reset? No, no, it's fine, it's fine. The natures aren't that big a deal. It's okay, it's okay, it's okay. Nice, Tris is intimidate empty. It's not that big a deal, it's not that big a deal. The biggest thing is just whether I get tricked. That's like the number one thing. Yikes, shakes, shakes. We wipe baby. Chat, do you think we're wiping? 
We could. I mean, we wiped yesterday. Nice. Light screen. Okay, Guardi goes for... Dazzling Gleam. Okay, fair bit of damage in the Grim Snarl. Looks like a three-hit KO. I get my Black Sludge. All right, we, it's kind of it's kind of all on you. I'm gonna Swords Dance here. Trick comes out into the Gardevoir. Oh, that's so good. It's so clutch. I have only plus zero though, right? Go for Swords Dance. It should always be Parting Shot, and I think they always Parting Shot me. Like, because of the Intimidated, still, I'm still gonna get my stats dropped here a fair bit. Can't tell it's targeting. Okay, I'm still plus one. That's super good. Okay, I'm plus one now. Okay, that's fine. Um, I didn't get tricked though, which is really good. So I believe the way the AI works is probably somewhat similar to Kaizo. I'm plus one because my wild comes in. Um, in that I think that if the AI sees a KO, it will go for the KO. Yeah, now I'm, I'm plus one. I'm even plus two now. I just got intimidated. Why would I be plus two? I, I swords engine and then got intimidated. Two minus one is one. Anyway, I think this means that my uh, Scolipede's actually safe to go for Stomping Tantrum. So Gardevoir's dying here, but hopefully we get a two shot on the uh, Mawile. Okay, Reflect going up is pretty bad. Please two shot. Oh god. Oh no. That did literally nothing. Is the Mawile faster than... Why did last time... Why last time did Explode not get an attack off? I don't remember. I guess let's Stomping Tantrum again here. I think it should be faster. Explode's higher base speed than Mawile. If it's... Okay, Boom Burst. Cool. Alright, killing Mawile is kind of a big deal here. It actually might get both. Nice. And it crit me. It crit me. Oh, it didn't crit me, I just died. Or I just took infinite damage. Wait, why is Explode so strong? I'm gonna protect here? As a boom burst? I think they're both forced to target me here. Oh wait, I guess that's just a spread move, that's fine. Throat spray is fine. Why? Why did it target there? <laughs> oh my god, why did it not target for the kill? Uh, does it have Shadow Sneak? Alright, their light screen's gone though, which is actually really good. I'm gonna go for Poison Jab into Primarina. It always changes, yep. Oh, I have to sack Scolipede. I forgot that this is a game where, like, if my mons die, they're, like, dead. Whatever, it's fine, it's fine. I'm just playing not to not to go eighth. Sorry, Scolipede, you did really well. Explode, you're the freaking worst. Truly the worst mon I've ever seen in my entire life. Oh! I love you, Explode. I love you, Explode, so much. Oh, my God. <laughs> I thought it was choice specs. <laughs> Scolipede, hang in there. Okay, I'm back to neutral, but it's fine. I get to over protect. They go for fake out into my Scolipede, yep. And then there should be Boom Burst, nice. This might actually just straight up kill. Super good, super, super good. Nice, okay. Good job, Explode. The King Shield. They didn't King Shield, all right. Kind of rude, but okay. Am I gonna lose a Mon because of a stupid Aegislash? I super am, aren't I? I can't believe it didn't King Shield. It was in range. Not into Scolipede. Survive, please. Oh, I didn't need to lose a Mon here. That feels really bad. Ah, oh, feels really bad. There was no need to lose a Mon there. I, I don't understand why it didn't King Shield. Whatever, I, I should win this fight now. I, I, I should've just switched to Gyarados and Dragonist. 
GD Garrow just wins. I don't know why it stayed in there. I thought that it, somebody told me that it always alternates, but apparently not. All right, I'm down to just attack. Ah, I could have just done that. There was no reason to stay in. It definitely twitches if it sees a kill because it did that versus the explode. So that's not why. It's, it's not. It's not because he saw the kill. This is our new furthest record. I have not played what is in here before. And we're gonna fight against Giovanni, which is apparently a very difficult fight, but I think that I um I think that I have a good team for it. I mean I didn't this is actually the least prepped I've been for any boss fight, because in theory Gliscor just sweeps the whole thing. So I just got Pokemon I thought would be strong. Oh no, I forgot to heal and then my glass is poisoned. So we're gonna taunt to ruin the roar. Can't you stealth mark? And then we're going to Sword Dance. Great. Big damage. It's so my leftovers. And then Poison Heal activates. Then I'm going to Sword Dance again. We'll go to plus six. And then I'll raise speed a couple times. This is probably a three shot, even though I'm plus six. It's a ton of damage. Okay, sand ends. That's really good timing. I don't have to worry about Sandville anymore. Or, uh, yeah, or a Sand Rush. I guess it could switch here. I'm sure you have again since it's two shots. I want you all to remember that in that tense situation where I almost had to sack him on, people were suggesting Glide Score. <laughs> no, all right, that's fine. It'll probably fake out here. Because I'm pre-poisoned, I don't even have to fear Body Slam. I'm gonna go back to full after this. Power Punch isn't a big deal because I Rock Polish, so I'm faster. Right now, plus six, it just feels... I mean, a plus six attack, right? Yeah. I don't need plus six speed. I'm already faster than everything. It should not one sh I Actually... Yeah, okay, no, one shot. It's fine. This is gonna do about half. No, not even close. Oh yeah, I'm super physically bulky. I'll actually be at full HP after poison the own leftovers. Okay, big Garchomp. This thing has Scale Shot, but it, I don't know what that does, so it's fine. It's, it's going to two-shot everything at this point, I think. I think, except me, it might one-shot the... That's so funny. <laughs> Alright, this is the most frightening one, because in theory it could sweep me if I don't get the one-shot. And I haven't one-shot anything so far. I definitely should have calc for this. I don't know what I was thinking. Okay, whew. I mean, it's not very bulky, and the other ones were very bulky, but even still, I got a little... What run is this? This is effectively our third serious run. I, like, messed around in the middle, but, like, this is the this is effectively the third run. Uh oh, I'm not gonna end the fight with full HP. Feels bad. All right, yeah, it's definitely worth. I think it's worth getting Gliscor just to solo this fight. Gliscor's been consistently good this whole run. We used it versus Erica. We used it versus Surge. That was the last gym later we fought, right? It's been consistently good. All right, GG Giovanni. King Shield no longer drops attack. I'm pretty sure it's I'm pretty sure it's Hone Edge. I'm taking Hone Edge. Abilities? Oops. Should be fine. Whatever. Swampert, this is a Stealth Rock. This thing is Stealth Rock, Flip Turn, Earthquake, and Liquidation. So I may as well just Mega Evolve off the bat. Cool. Enter is how I do that. 
I could have just outright killed it, but it seems like a good opportunity to set up. Because if I set up, I can potentially... I could, in theory, depending on the order, kill every Mon. Um, that's probably not what happens, though. Stealth Rock, that's fine. Oh, yeah, I kind of forgot that Stealth Rock were going to be up. Wait, I kind of forgot that Stealth Rocks were going to be up. Yeah, that's alright, though. It's not a huge deal. Bye-bye. Nice Rindo Berry. Alright, five left. Pelipper, all right, that's fine. Bye-bye. Okay. Bye-bye. It resists? Bug resists grass! Please don't hit twice. Oh, no. Please go for dance. I'm super dead. I just lost my Mega Sceptile. <laughs> Why did the Calx Knight just killed? I'm super dead. I do not live this. Max HP? <laughs> Why did I think... <sighs> Why did the calc say that killed? I calc that. Oh, it defaults to three hits. I thought it defaulted to two hits. Oh, well, bicep dial. Whatever, it's fine. I don't care. <laughs> uh, oops, that's my bad. That's alright. I don't, like, I don't need it. It's fine. I don't care. Okay, Swampert, the reason I did this is to bait this, so I could go into this. And then Earthquakes for a lot of damage. Good thing I have Citrus Berry. There's no point fake outing in case it switches. It's faster than me, despite the fact that I eevee to be faster. Why is it faster than me? I wiped the EVs and never re eevee Oh, now we have a problem. This thing has superpower, which probably kills me realistically. Go into one jelly. Bullet punch? Okay, just bullet punch for some reason. Scald here. Turn into Swampert. Wants to Earthquake here, right? That's fine. I can go into this. Does it have an Ice move? It is Ice Punch. I'm not dead to that. I'm Thick Fat. Okay. Nice. I can Protect here. Megahorn. All right. Now it wants to go for Megahorn. Okay. I didn't give myself any moves. Okay. Interesting decision by me. Flip turn into that. Okay. This thing wants to go for Bullet Punch, which is fine. Swords Dance, that's not good. Uh-oh. U-turn, okay. Wants to Earthquake. I took a lot of damage from that. Please don't kill me, okay. <laughs> okay, that was Omega Sloppy. That was, that was Omega Omega Sloppy. <laughs> My Looney's own tempo. <laughs> okay, let's fix that right now. <laughs> I swear I'm not throwing for content. <laughs> I swear I'm not the room for content. I'm just being stupid. All right, I don't like subtitle anyways. Bye bye. All right, let's give it a shot. Oh, I wasn't reading the dialogue. I didn't, didn't check my tentacles moves, but I can't imagine it's that big a deal. It's a single battle, right? Yeah. Dude, I have a rain team. Like Misty's not helping herself. She's only helping me. <laughs> Okay, faster. No poison damage on that team, so it's just perma. It's always flip turn here, I think. Okay. Not very much damage. I don't know who she goes into here. Ideally, it's Gorbis. I don't think. I don't know why it'd be Gorbis though. Ah, uh, Jaredus. All right, that's not ideal. It's not so bad though. B Gyarados. Is this thing DDs? Uh oh. <laughs> no, it's fine. There's no way there's only one shots me. Right? I maybe should have a Citrus Berry, because like plus one flinches could be bad. I just still have Looty though. I'm just gonna Horn Leech. Ah, uh, yeah, maybe I should have Spiky Shield, but I was worried it was gonna. This shouldn't do that much, right? Oh, yeah, it's fine. Iron Barb. I just need an off flinch. Well, oh, that's bad. Oh no. <laughs> I might wipe. Okay. I can't take another one of those. <laughs> I think I'll lose. Um, okay, it's fine. It's fine, it's fine, fine. I can still win this. Um, okay, it's more damage. I shouldn't have done that the first time, but I wasn't sure if it was going to Dragon Dance again. But Chizon is not useless, unfortunately. Take the Waterfall. It's four times resist. 
I think Gara might one-shot me is the issue with Crunch. Oh, I definitely one-shots with Crunch. Two turns of rain left, so I always fake out here. Oh, okay, we're fine. All right, it's fine. Kingdra, okay, that's super fine. Yeah, I mean, it's not ideal, of course, by any means, but we're, we're okay for sure. Because now the Gyarados can't switch in without getting poisoned, so it's fine. Um, although I did lose the rain, so it's actually, we're not totally out of the woods yet. No reason not to protect here. The yeah, I just threw, it switched because it thought I was in range and I was faster, so it didn't throw. I, it ran the, it ran the Calc and it thought it would kill. Yeah, it's not 100% accurate without being in the rain. And they have, she has no freeze dry switch in. If she goes into Gorbis now, she's in trouble. Same with Gyarados. There's not that many Pokemon she can even go into. Let's freeze dry, faster, timid. Bye bye. That's right, fine. Okay, Gyarados again, but this time it's poisoned. And now I can go into Ludicolo. Cute, perfect. I mean, actually, not perfect, but I'm Jiggy Draining here for the kill. I don't think she has any. Good switch into Ludi anymore. I'm, I should have been modest. Being timid here might actually really cost me. Because it's probably Inteleon, and I think because I'm timid, I might not one shot. Should be a one shot. I don't think Air Slash kills me, but the crit it might, though. Yeah, it has this scope lens. Alright, that was one of the more threatening Pokemon, so I'm glad it's gone. This thing isn't threatening. Just to drain it. It has Hypnosis, but it will never click it because. Um. I have a chest of berries, so it doesn't want to click hypnosis, it just flip turns, I think. Maybe ice beam, I guess. No, just flip turns. Greninja? Alright, after the poison damage, this should definitely kill. Also, Greninja doesn't have a flying move, so I can just chicken it. It's dark, ice, grass, water. Yeah, if Intellion dies, Greninja should definitely die. It goes first, okay. This is the furthest attempt. Does it always hit five times? No. Or all the poison does have toxic spikes, so it's life orb. <clears throat> GG. It's annoying, because now it's fine, actually. <laughs> I love Ludicolo Dog. Great one. I wish it was better in current format. 2014 Ludicolo, oh, it was so good. It was legit so good. All right. I still don't know what Ash Greninja does. I just know that the singles players are like, oh, Ash Greninja, oh. oh man, good thing I could practice and I'm on Kaizo getting a bunch of flinches. First trainer is this. Behold, now, you are pertain, right? If it's not pertain, I'm about to be in a world of trouble. Okay. Flinch. Crit doesn't matter. Nice. And now that I have no item, I can acrobatics. The reason I use fling here, acrobatics, is because it breaks the focus dash. <laughs> so let's me do this. Flop comes out. This is the mega. I will go for ice beam. Good for one shot. Yeah. So Greninja actually solos this whole first battle. They get Reggie um, Drago's ability, by the way. So if it hits me, I'm dead, but it's not going to hit me because I'm killing it with Ice Beam. It has Blade Master, so I have to be careful, except that I'm not speeding it, and I have to have Ice Beam for the one shot. I'm dead. Why is Farfetch not speeding me? It's, it's not Scarf. It's level, it's Leak. Leak is plus one speed. <gasps> oh no. Oh, okay, that's really bad. Did not realize it was plus one speed. Brave Bird, okay. It crits me always. Oh, it didn't crit. Okay, that's really bad. Greninja's pretty good. It was just barely faster. It's fine. It just sucks, but it's fine. 
Oh, uh, that's alright. Whatever. Um, there's the crit. GG to the run? No, it's fine. We don't need Greninja. I have Corsal. Like, I don't need Greninja. Like, it was, Greninja was just good, but it wasn't necessary. No, I can't get another one. I'm playing a Species Claws. Raver? Do not Night Slash this time. Okay. Uh, it should still be fine, except that now the Dodrio is a lot more problematic, unfortunately. I'm just gonna go for Iron Head. Okay, this should crit. This always crits. Err, uh, yeah, it should always crit. It should a lot. Thank you for the gift sub to Shady. Thank you, thank you. Um. This next battle becomes a lot harder, though, unfortunately. Like, way harder. Oh, man. Oh, I didn't even see it was Focus Ash. That's not good either. Okay, Dodrio is the lead. Um, Rockhead Dodrio, so it doesn't take recoil. It's going to be going for Brave Bird or for Double Edge here. Oh, I'm super stupid. All right, it's fine. Um, I only have two more Strength Sap left. I'm going to use one now. Okay. This better not be Apple. Okay, that's fine. Why Chinchino, though? I don't understand. Um, okay. Probably goes for Triple Axel here. I could burn it if I wanted. Um. Yeah, I can burn it. Nice. And what I can do now is use the opportunity to set up my Aegislash, or heal up my Aegislash, just to say. Although I don't actually know if I heal that much. Okay, she switches. Dodrio again. All right, this is fine. It only has Pursuit to hit me. Got a King Shield. Get some health back. This. Okay, that's fine. Doesn't do that much damage, and then I get to it for Iron Head. <sighs> Thank you for the gift sub. I appreciate that. I should two shots. Yeah, that's definitely two shots. Yeah, easy two shot. All right, cool. Braver's stronger still, right? Yeah, yeah Braver's still stronger. So I guess it just keeps Brave Birding. Yeah, it feels bad to lose Greninja, but it's okay. You live and you learn. At least I don't need the Grass Knot TM anymore. <laughs> What's up, Sama? <laughs> yeah, in this game, they nerfed Aegislash. They lowered its base to HP, I believe, and also made King Shield not actually do anything. Like, doesn't do anything if you make contact. All right. There's no reason not to. Oh, I could get t wave but I think it wants to Fire Punch me. Aegislash actually is my answer to this, but I have Marowak as a backup, so I'm just going to go Marowak here and click Shadow Bone. I can actually click Flame Charge if I wanted. Yep. Let's click Shadow Bone here. I'm faster, actually. Should be a two shot easily. Okay, it's just a crit. Greninja for no reason to Farfetch'd. It's a strong Farfetch'd is. My own fault. Should not have underestimated it. I was, wondering, I was wondering why Farfetch was on the team because it's such a, like, it, it was like, it looks so out of place compared to the other mons. The Mega does not change type, but it gains Contrary. So Leaf Storm and Draco Meteor raise special attack instead of lowering it. Yeah, that's alright. You'll even learn. I was, like, the thing about Radical Red is you get so many good Pokemon. No, uh, Apple's Mega gets con a Contrary. Flopple gets Regirio's ability. 